another Jennifer point. Uh, we recuse from running this meeting. Uh, we recruited Bernard Closer to be the moderator. Okay, can everybody hear me? We don't have an amplification system, but can you probably hear me? Okay, I would be considered the moderator pro tem until the election takes place. Okay? Are there any questions first of all? No. All right. Let me remind you. This is a meeting of the Longsford Water and Sewer District, and you have to meet two criteria to participate and speak. You must, one, be a registered voter in the town, and two, you must live within the Rawlinsford Water and Sewer District. If you don't live within the district or you're not a registered voter, you cannot participate. Sorry about that. You can observe, but you can't participate. Are we clear? Everybody should have gotten who's eligible one of these things. And you're going to need it if we have to call for a hand vote. All right, Article 1 is to choose the officers of the district. The first is to elect a moderator for the district. Are there any nominations? I nominate Vernon Broder. I'll second that. I'll second it. I'll second it. Are there any other nominations for moderator? All right. Hearing none, I will direct the clerk to cast one ballot for me to be moderator. That's how it's done. For a clerk of the district, are there any nominations for a clerk of the district? I nominate Gail St. Hilaire. Gail St. Hilaire is nominated. Do I hear a second? Second. Ken Shorey seconds. Are there any other nominations for clerk of the district? I'm looking around, I'm looking around, I don't see any. I therefore direct the clerk to cast one ballot for the clerk as Gail St. Hilaire. Treasurer of the district, are there any nominations? I'll nominate Jamie Printy. Jamie Printy by this St. Hilaire guy. <laughs> are there any seconds? I second. It is seconded. Are there any other nominations for treasurer of the district? Hearing none, I direct the clerk to cast one vote for the treasurer, Mr. Printy. One commissioner to serve until the annual meeting of the district in March, in March, on March 31st, 2020. It's a three-year term. Are there any nominations for this commissioner? I, I nominate uh, Caitlin Rollo. I second. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Who's second? It's C A I T. I'm sorry, C. Doesn't matter. Motion by Patrick Hayden, seconded by Tom Cooks. Are there any other nominations for commissioner? Yes. I nominate Dan Sinclair. Dennis St. Hilaire is nominated. Who seconds? I'll second him. Al Dion seconds. <coughs> Are there any other nominations for commissioner? Hearing none, we will go to a vote. How do you folks want to do it? Do you want to do it by hand count or by ballot? Hand count. Huh? By hand. Very well. Anybody who has one of these blue cards? Caitlin Rollo was first nominated. Those in favor of Caitlin Rollo, please raise your blue card. Okay. Charlie, Charlie, can you do up the aisle and back? Count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And you get the ones in back, right? I got 17. 17. 18. 19. 20. You can put your cards down so that you can get the ones in the back. Those 
in favor of Dennis St. Hilaire, please raise your cards. Again. All right, all right. You do the table up there, and I'll do this. Okay. One. Is your card up or down? Well, wait. Is your card up? Or what? Well, it's 13. I've got this. Thank you. You can put your cards down.
unless there's some objection. Those in favor? Do I hear an objection? No? All right. Those in favor, say aye. 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 Those opposed? <coughs> Hearing none opposed, it is passed. Article 5, Sewer Fund Balance. To see if the district will vote to raise and appropriate $38,889 for maintenance and repairs to the wastewater treatment plant and the collection system and to authorize such sum to come from the fund balance with no amount to come from taxation. Are there any questions on this matter? Hearing none, I will call for a voice vote. Those in favor of Article 5, say aye. 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 Those opposed? Hearing no opposition, the article is passed. Article 6, to see if the district will approve additions, deletions, and or changes to the ordinances of the district as submitted by the commissioners. Are there any changes, additions, or? Yeah. There are. Okay, here's one. It's more of a clarification. It's more of a clarification than an actual addition or change. And I will read it. A new unit is any unit added to an existing building that has a separate use, such as a mother-in-law apartment or creating a duplex from a one-family house. This would also apply to anyone converting office space, etc., into a dwelling like an apartment or condo. Each separate unit will have its own meter and require entrance fees to be paid before construction. The payment will come from the owner of the building before the permit, I presume the building permit. Is it the building permit? Or the entrance permit? Before the entrance permit will be issued. Are there any questions on this change in the ordinances? Yeah, the end went up. Yes. Can you that General John Sullivan way? I guess I'm concerned about what I'm reading, what I'm not seeing, and I'm a we want to allow the commissioners to approve any corrections or deletions or changes without knowing what they are. Right. I don't know what the this ordinances is, are. This is the this Was is it just that one you said? That's yeah. the only change. Because I don't see them here. Oh, you That's don't? That's why I'm asking. All I see is your ordinances. I don't see what the ordinances are, but if it's like authorized. Are, are you looking at the warrant or are you looking at this paper that has the actual verbiage on it? Oh, wait a minute. That's the final one. This is what the new ordinance is. So it's only for this ordinance Correct. that we're voting on. Yeah. Correct. All right, because that's not what I how I read it. I know. I read it as anything that's coming up, and I'm concerned with that. The only thing that can come up is what they submit to the voters, and it has Thank to be you. in writing like this. Thank you. Are there any other questions? Hearing none, I will call for a voice vote. Those in favor of passing Article 6, the ordinance change, please signify by saying aye. Aye. Those opposed? Hearing none, the Article 6 is passed. Article 7 to transact any other business that may legally come before said meeting. Are there, is there any other matter which may legally come before this meeting? Commissioners? Nothing? We're good. Uh, I just have one thing. I think all of spoke about the water quality and the people were complaining about our water. The people were complaining about our water on Facebook and where they go on. And uh, if you have a complaint, we have, a, we have a, an office where people can call in Anytime. If the water smells, if there's too much chlorine in it, this if you've got amazing. grease in it. So that's it. If anybody has any questions on the water, please stand and okay. let us know. Do you have a question or comment? Comment. He's directing it stand. to me. So Who else, please? Okay. Trace Gordon. Um, it was brought to my attention that there has been some families, newer families, younger families, I'm not sure. Um, that they have tried to get a hold of the water department through email or I'm not sure. I know email for sure and no response back. So I, I was, when I heard the meeting, I encouraged people to come so that they can ask questions, find out and get the information 
hearing that the email that is on the website or whatever? It's on the it website. is now corrected. We okay. did not know that the town had put our information on the website, so we didn't know it wasn't correct. Okay. Until somebody contacted me and said, you're not answering my emails. And I said, I'm not getting any emails. And then I asked where they got the email address, and they said, from the town website. Then we found out there was a website. And then we tried to put the corrections on there. We asked to have it posted. So the correct email address is on there now. Is oh. that website updated? And um, I, it's a town website. We have no control over. If the water doesn't have its own, no. own little drop down or, or no. But you can call us. Um, we meet um, the second Thursday of every month. And your um, member information is on the website, the town website? It's also in the town report. Yes. What is the town report? The town report that we got at the so end of the book. Okay, well, these are new families, and, and oh, right. they, 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 they don't have that. So the, town, the town home knows our phone number and knows how to okay. get in touch with us. The town home is there. Okay, that, I'm just trying to right. get information. Right. We have our no If anybody okay. has a problem, they need to call. But we don't know that there's a problem, and we can't fix it if nobody okay. tells us. Okay. So, if you have any problem, call. Yes. Comments about the department? Wait a minute. Wait. Your name? No. Uh, comments about the department. Douglas Watson, 63 Pine Street. I had my first issue ever with the water department this year. Been in town for a long time. This man in the middle, John England, was in my dooryard all day long. They had a water leak in front. I just wanted to say that I had a great experience with going down to the office, the young lady that was in the office, and also with John in my dooryard all day. He let me do an excellent. When you say young lady, you're not talking about yeah. you. No, I'm not talking about you. Excuse me, Meredith Boyd. No, that's not true. Are there any comments or concerns that might legally come before this meeting? Hearing none, none, I will call for a motion to adjourn. So moved. Let me show moves. Who was the second? Was that you, Kathy? Kathy Land seconds. The meeting is adjourned. This was a very long meeting.